Welcome to prayer and Bible coffee this morning. In John 13, Jesus, knowing that the Father had given all things to his hands, that he had come from God and was going to God, rose from supper and laid aside his garments, took a towel and girded himself. After that, he poured water into a basin and began to wash the disciples' feet and to wipe them with the towel with which he was girded. Jesus knew who he was. Not just, he knew where he was going. And he knew what he had. And he knew what he was doing. Do you know what who you are? Not just here, but in the spiritual realm. Do you know where you're going in eternity? And do you know what you have in Christ? And do you know what you're doing for him? Ephesians 1, that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of glory, may give to you the spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of him, the eyes of your understanding being enlightened, that you may know what is the hope of his calling, what the, are the riches of the glory of his inheritance in the saints. We're going to talk more about it tonight at our Wednesday Bible study. And we invite you to join us as we talk about who we are in Christ and becoming who you are in Christ. Let's pray. Jesus, you loved us so much. You gave us, you gave your life that we might have eternal life and your life in us. So many don't know you. And there are many more who think they know you, but they don't have a real relationship, an intimate relationship with you. We're going to gather in your house tonight, and we're going to gather as your church, and we're going to look into your word one more time. And you've promised to be there through Holy Spirit to enlighten our eyes. Give someone a nudge today that it's time for them to gather with the body of Christ and find out more about you. Give a nudge to those who haven't been to your ecclesia, your church, in a while. Tell them it's time to come home and be reminded of what your word says about who we are when we're in Christ. And in the name of the word made flesh, your name, Jesus, amen.